In this video, we take this great big petrol-powered RC car and see how it compares to a load of electric ones. No, 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 no. So this video is brought to you by Manscaped, the world's best grooming and hygiene products for men. Manscaped offers the best tools and potions for the big three odour zones. Your body, butt and balls. Guys, the build quality looks absolutely epic. It's got a headlight and ceramic blades. This is the fourth generation electric waterproof trimmer with advanced skin safe technology. Oh yeah, it's been a while. Oh yeah, that's better. And to charge it up, you plug that into there and donk that into there. Also in the box, you get ball toner and ball deodorant. This is the weed whacker, nose and ear hair trimmer. Man, I hate ear and nose hairs. That's better. And for a limited time, you get all this and two free gifts. The shed travel bag and Manscaped anti-chafing boxer shorts. So go to manscaped.com to get 20% off, two free gifts, free international shipping when you enter promo code TALBOT at checkout. Your balls will thank you. My friends are not impressed with the noise. In this video, we're going to bash that. Footage! What? What happened there? You run yourself over. Oh, the clutch has seized up. Game over! How unfortunate! Oh! Yeah, that was the shortest video ever! High <laughs> <laughs> five! So we're back in the shop, we're gonna fix it, and then we're gonna take it out and give it a rip. But man, this car is loud and this exhaust is why. Enough waffle, let's get wrenching, then go ripping. Not really sure how it comes out, so we'll just make it up as we go along. No, that one. So this pinion gear here is supposed to spin freely and it isn't, look, it's turning the whole engine. I don't really have a clue about working on these things, so we've got to make up as we go along. I'm guessing we take off these four screws here, hopefully the clutch will come out and we can see what the problem is. So this part spins perfectly, and that in there, to me, looks... Ah, ha ha ha, look, that screw's come loose. So I reckon that screw there was rubbing inside here and it was making some clicking noises before, so that is probably it. So we'll do the bolts up, get the engine back in, and then we'll take it out for a rip. So we get a little bit of Loctite on there. Boom! And there we go, ready for action. All right, let's go! So while I wasn't looking, my car rolled off and nearly ran over Claire. I've got really carry one of them. That's cool. And X Max is trying to make me dirty. All right, let's go. Let's let it win. Look at that for a line up. Ready, steady, go, 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 go! So with no idea where the end of the racetrack was, I went to the end of the field and everybody else turned round early. I don't know, I've gone too far. I was first and I'm last. Oh, look, 
there's Steve in the house. Hello. We got, we got X Max. Yeah, it might be a broken X Max now. Oh, as usual, big motor, big speed controller, lots of lipos. I've just had a Max Five die as well. Oh, what's going on with this? It looks a bit longer than normal. Is that yours? Yeah. My Harvey chassis. Oh. Only got the old metal diff cases. Oh yeah. Every time metal diff. Motor out of a Outcast AS. It's um, nice. <laughs> Not impressed. Uh oh, lock jump. Normally everything breaks when we hit that. Hopefully the loss is going to survive. <laughs> So the lossy ran the whole entire outing on one tank of juice while everybody else kept having to change lipos. Absolutely epic piece of kit and if you want to know where we can get one from, there's going to be a link to that down below. 